So hello everyone, this is my first live stream on my channel. I am very scared. I go live every time on Instagram. I'm hoping it's actually live because I am I have my laptop open so I can read the chat better because the chat on my iPad is not fun. Oh, there we go. Now I can see if it looks fine. Oh god, is it pixelated? Okay, no, it looks fine. <laughs> so hello everyone. I just thought it'd be fun to go live and chat with you guys on YouTube. It's also weird because I can see myself because I have my laptop open. I wish I could cover that, but it's the only way I could read the chat because I don't like the chat on my iPad. <laughs> I hope everything sounds fine too. Waiting, okay. I think the chat's a little delayed. So I'm gonna start. Um, in the description box down below, I have the pattern for, um, I'm gonna have to close this tab. I don't wanna see myself, <laughs> hold up. I have the pattern for Baby Yoda, which, where did I set him? Oh my god, he's all the way over there. Hold up. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Okay, I got him. It's also weird, because I don't know why that's being weird. It's fine. Anyways, I have the pattern for Baby Yoda, so here he is. I have the pattern. I didn't do the band count. I was too lazy to do band math today. It is fine. But yeah, so we're going to make him, I thought it would just be fun to loom in chat, so if you have any questions, we can answer those. I also hate that my iPad, like, laptop's so far away, but, uh, hey Ginger, thanks for doing my panda. Oh, thank you for asking me. I'm glad I finally did the panda tutorial. How long ago did you ask me to do that? It was, like, months. That was my bad. He's cute. Oh, thank you. Say hello to, I, I did say hello to you guys. So hello to everyone who's here and chatting. Um, Bread's my sibling, if you wonder why she's being all chaotic. That is what's happening. But, yeah. <laughs> I'm surprised there's so many people here. I usually only get, like, ten people on Instagram, so... Can you say hi to Abby? Yes, I can say hi to Abby. I, I, I never know how to do that. I'm just, uh, yeah, awkward. Um, yeah, I don't like that my laptop's so fine. Um, it's fine. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna start making Yoda, because I need to do something with my hands, because... I am slightly nervous. <laughs> oh my god. I wish I could move my iPad back, but I'm like afraid to touch it because it took me forever to set it up. And it was a problem. So I'm going to start making Grogu or Baby Yoda. I don't know. Anyway, what should I loom? Yeah, so you guys can loom along with me. If you're looming, let me know what you're making. I'm making Baby Yoda because why not? And yeah, and you can loom whatever you want. If you haven't made my reindeer yet, I recommend my reindeer. Because I love my reindeer. Oh god, there's so many chat. I, I thought I could loom and keep up with the chat. That's not looking like it's going to happen. Okay. Okay, let me read. Um, where do I get the rare colors? The loom kits I always get are just neon colors. And most colors aren't sold in individual bags where I live. Um, the Rainbow Loom web store. If you're not from the US, though, the shipping is going to be ridiculous. So just be prepared for that. But I get all my fancier bands, I guess, from like the Rainbow Loom web store. Um, I also just keep looking over here because the chat's over here. Uh, I'm bad at reading the chat. <laughs> hey, Ginger, I'm like a huge fan. I made all your designs. I love them. Oh, thank you. Can you give me an idea what to loom? Um, I don't know if you want to design something or if you are, like, saying for my channel. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. What should you loom? I'm recommending my reindeer to everyone because I really like it. It just turned out so well, you know? Uh, what else? Let's see. Reindeer is... It. Okay. Uh, already made the reindeer. Going to make another one right now. Yes. Make a billion reindeers. I have my three reindeers. They're over there. I'm, I'm not going to get them. They're too far. When are you posting the tutorial for the goose? Um, I completely forgot about the goose. <laughs> what did I do with the goose? I... I don't know if I like it. I'm like iffy on the goose. I know when I posted the goose, you guys were like, I want a tutorial for it. I was like, no, nah, I, I don't like the goose. Actually, I wonder if I could scroll down and still see the chat. I can't. I, I left my pattern somewhere <laughs> for Grogu. It's fine. I can read. The, I remember the pattern. Reindeer supremacy. Yes, bread. Reindeer supremacy. When are you making a sleigh in Santa for a reindeer collection? Girl, don't be saying that. So Brad's my sibling. And they're causing chaos. I'm never making that. Um, I feel bad because I keep looking sideways. But, like, I need to work out my setup if I go live again. Because I thought it was going to go smooth with my iPad. But it's not. It's not going. I have to keep looking sideways. 
Are you excited for Christmas? No, I think I've said this in a lot of my videos. I'm not a Christmas person at all. Um, I don't know. I've just never really liked Christmas. I mean, no, I'm not excited for it. Like, nah, <laughs> just not at all. Um, will you be sharing the pattern for the Tsum Tsum? Yeah, the Tsum Tsum pattern, if it, you checked earlier and it wasn't in the description... It's in the description now. I, up I uploaded it a couple hours ago. It should be there. I think I can check. Is it there? Yeah, the pattern's there. You can just scroll down. And it'll be there. <laughs> oh, gosh, yeah. I, I don't know. I'm not a Christmas person. Oopsies. Can you make the Grinch? I should make the Grinch. I feel like it would be appropriate. My sister says I'm a Grinch because I don't like Christmas that much. So, yeah, I'm also sitting in the chair I used to have in my apartment, and that's why I keep moving. Oops. <laughs> this chair's just fun to move in. I should not be allowed to have a chair that moves. I, I just, I don't sit still. Okay, there's a lot of questions. I'm trying to start. I don't think I'm going to be able to make a soup soon. This is my first time going live. I do I haven't talked to a lot of you, so I'm just going to focus on the chat for a minute. Okay, where did I leave off in the chat? Uh, I want to make Grogu, will you teach us a pattern? Um, I have a video on how to read my patterns, which now I'm realizing I forgot to link in the description. But if you Google it, it should come up. But I kind of can't make a tutorial for it because there's a bunch of Yoda tutorials already. So I don't want to, like, make a tutorial for something that already exists. So I just give you guys the pattern because it's, like, a variation or something. So you can follow the pattern, but I can't really make a tutorial. And if I got farther along, I could teach you the trickier parts, but I keep getting distracted by the chat, so it's fine. Uh, can you make a tutorial for a giraffe? I really want to make a giraffe design, but I feel like giraffe is also, like, giraffe's been on my design, like, to make list for a while. But I'm just hesitant to make a giraffe because, like, I love giraffes and I want it to be perfect, so <laughs> I just haven't made one for that reason. Uh, okay. How did you start making your own patterns? I kind of just started experimenting when I couldn't, like, find things for, like, oh my gosh, what am I trying to say? I couldn't find, like, designs that were for things I wanted, so I just started designing my own stuff, and it was, it was hard at first, definitely. I, I did a video with Brad, my sibling, actually, a while ago, where we looked at a lot of my old creations, and you can see that some of them are not so great, so... Yeah, it just takes practice. It's just what happens. And I'm also putting way too many stitches in this cat band. I'm trying to work on Grogu, but I don't think it's going to happen. But we want your Grogu. Um, yeah, I can only give you the pattern, sadly. I just always feel weird, because I know if somebody made a design similar to mine, I would not want to make a tutorial. So I'm not going to make a tutorial for the Grogu, but you can have the pattern. And hopefully you can figure it out. I love Hello Kitty. Can you loom it if you can? I have a, like, I need to pull up. I have a Lumagurumi, like, to make list where anything you guys suggest, I put on the list. And then whenever I'm, like, bored, I visit the list and I'll be like, maybe I should make that. But I don't know. <laughs> it also just depends if I'm inspired to make the thing because if I'm not, it just doesn't happen. Can you make a unicorn? Someone was going to request a unicorn. So if you don't know about the unicorn, every time I go live on Instagram, someone always comments, can you make a unicorn? And I'm always like, hmm. There's been multiple attempts at a unicorn and it just, it never happens. It doesn't, it doesn't go well. I also really can't sit still in this chair. Oh my God. Thank you for the super, what are they like? Super chats? I think they're called. <laughs> I've never had one of those. I forget that that's a thing in it. But yeah, oh my god, thank you so much. And I'm glad you like my tutorials and patterns. I always, like, appreciate you guys making my things because it's an excuse for me to make it. Ginger has five failed unicorn designs. That's what my sibling Brett is saying. Yes, I do. I have five. Over five, honestly. I have too many. The unicorn, the day I make a unicorn is the day I can retire because I need C-clips. I'm sorry, I forgot my C-clips. But the day I make a unicorn is going to be the day I retire because God, my sister's being chaotic in the chat. So if you're watching this video back, you can't see the live chat unless you hit the thing. But my sibling Brett just said, loom, the people want you to loom. Oh my God. <laughs> they should not be encouraging the chaos, but they are in fact encouraging the chaos. So, And I'm trying to loom, but I keep forgetting 
Did I do this right? We have this much of a Grogu. I'm using, today I'm using, well for my Grogu I'm gonna use these glow-in-the-dark bands. He was with some off-brand bands. I also discovered I don't have any, like, peach for his robe left, so he's gonna have a gray robe. I didn't know what color to give him. And then, I'm using pink still, so, yeah. I'm excited to make another one. I really like this design. I think I need to make a smaller Mandalorian. Um, okay. <laughs> You're one of the only people who puts a pattern in the descriptions. I know, and I actually do that because it's a pet peeve of mine when I would follow stuff, and they wouldn't put the pattern in the description. I hated it. I couldn't do it. I wanted the pattern. Did not have the patience. So now, whenever, I just put the pattern in the description for you guys, so that way you don't have the same problems. I, I don't, I'm so bad at saying names, but I think it's, I don't get, but hi to the people. I'm not going to bother. I'm so sorry. I never bother with usernames. Uh, uh, I can see the pattern. I don't know what we're talking about there. <laughs> uh, if you can, Ginger, do a loom craft with all of us here. Yeah, I'm making Grogu. It's just, I, if I, like, this is my first time trying a live stream, so I kind of knew this was going to be shaky. But if I do it again in the future, I'm going to see if I can do a better setup. Because right now, we have my iPad on top of two band cases and then my laptop over here so I can read the chat. So if I go live again, I'll try to do better. I kind of want to do one more live stream before I go back to school, but we'll see. We will see. But I am looming. It's just... I'm making Grogu because I figured it's appropriate. And Loom With Me's I usually do when these are like videos. I make whatever's in the description. So I'm making Grogu. Also because I want to. I'm heading back to work now, but thanks again. Hope your living goes well. Take care. Oh, thank you. And then Nicole Maxwell says she's making a pink Yoshi. Good job. Is there a Yoshi design? I wish I had somewhere. To, my desk is such a disaster right now. I have nowhere to put my pants. I'm just going to put them on my laptop. It's That's where they're going to have to go. But yeah, if you guys want to have any questions, you can ask me in the chat. Other than that, I think I'm just going to chat while I loom. We'll see how far we get with Grogu. I'm only going to be live for about an hour just because I don't want this video to be ridiculously long on my channel afterwards. I am going to leave it up so you guys can watch it. If you for some reason want to watch this afterwards. Uh, I'm looming on Grogu with a Christmas sweater. That is genius. Maybe I should give him a different outfit because the thing is like before I was coming live I was like what color do I make his robe? I'm completely out of peach. I need to I need to order more bands, kind of. I also just realized I forgot to get the eyes for this guy. Oops. I'm gonna have to go get him a few. <laughs> Make a festive Grogu. No. Not a festive Grogu. I won't like him then. I'm not a Christmas person. I'm looming with Grogu. Yeah, okay, I read that one. <laughs> oh my god. Brett's causing a revolution in the chat. It's fine. The Yoshi is on the loom, except the nose is crochet. Ooh, that's cute. Sounds cute. I, I think I followed, or I, Nicole shows me her stuff on Instagram sometimes, so you have to make it for me. Not make it. Um, Show it to me when you're done making it. Wrong way. What was I doing? <laughs> I'm going to do this by memory, because I don't... Wait, I, I'm going to grab my pattern real quick, because I need to get the eyes. I need to get pattern for Grogu. I forgot before I went live. I thought I had everything. I did not. Hold okay. We're good. I got all my things. I didn't put my headphones back on. I also probably shouldn't just drop these. They have the microphone in them. Whoops. But I got the eyes, so we have my Jaro eyes here for Grogu, and I got my pattern book. I'm so sad. I'm almost out of pages in this book. I keep posting on Instagram, like, I'm so sad, because this book has had all my loom patterns since I literally started doing my own designs, and now there's only, like, I think four pages left, and I'm done. So I'm sad. It's going to be ending. I'm in the middle of making a reindeer. Is it my reindeer, Peter, or is it somebody else's reindeer? <laughs> Uh, Nicole Maxwell said they have new kits of Michaels where I live. I haven't seen. I think you did. I think you. Someone messaged me about new kits of Michaels. I forget who, but somebody did. And I haven't seen any at my Michaels. But like even when everyone was like really hyping up the like pastel buckets, it took two more months for me my the Michael I the Michaels I go to to get the buckets. So I don't think they're gonna be here for like I'm gonna go back to school 
and they're still not going to be here. I'm going to have to wait till I come back in like the spring. Uh, Huzzah says I am in the middle of making a penguin. I don't know who's, is it my penguin design? You guys have to tell me. I want to know if it's mine or not. Okay. I don't think I'm going to get much farther in this grow room. It's also weird, I swear. It's so, I, I'm going to have to post a photo of my setup for my live stream after because it's so weird. But, um, yeah. I also was so lo like, huh? I just realized I left my grow guys at home. Yeah, I'm lucky I had my bin here. <laughs> but, oops. If not, I mean, you could use bands. You're just going to have to make something else. I hate when I do that, when you leave your supplies somewhere. What the heck did I do here? I am not paying attention. I just nearly put three stitches in the same loop. I'm using your pattern and giving it to my cousin. Ooh, okay, Peter said that's so what he's talking about, like, the reindeer. I'm trying not to be too much of a disaster. I actually follow these art people who go live all the time, and they have such a fancy live stream setup. My setup is chaotic, definitely, for sure. Uh, okay, Nicole Maxwell said, I made all of my parts of my Yoshi. Now I need to put them all together. Ooh, good luck. I feel like putting it together is always the hardest part. I've noticed that, like, Lumagurmi, when I see, like, beginners making it, um, they always have the hardest part with the attaching. I also realized I probably should have put that I'm live on Instagram. I haven't done that. I think I'm just going to give up. I'm not going to post about it. <laughs> it's fine. Like, my phone's too far. It's too much effort. We're just going to chill. Um, how do I make the reindeer and watch you, Ginger? You're going to need two devices. That's all I have to say. Er... I mean, you could... No, I don't know how you could do it. <laughs> I don't know at all. Good luck. Oh, man, I forgot to put the other eye on. Okay, wait. This is the third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh. The eye goes here. But, yeah. Yep, I'm trying not to let it go to awkward silence. Because, like, I really need to... I don't know. I'm kind of sad because the camera I use for my tutorials does not work for live streams. I knew that when I bought it because it... Has to have some fancy port, and I don't have it. The pink I'm using is the Jelly Rose from the web store. Nice. Pink Yoshi. So cute. I, I wonder, I think I know which Yoshi you're making, but I'm not 100% certain. I'm so, like, uh, I don't know. It's just, like, kind of intimidating because, like, whenever I go live on Instagram, I can burn the footage after, but this is going to live on my channel forever. Unless I delete it. That's horrifying. I don't know why. <laughs> Ginger will fly to your house and go down your chimney like a Santa to teach the reindeer pattern. <laughs> what the heck? So my sibling Brad said that. I will not be doing that. I can't. Oh, God. <laughs> Brad is... Oh my gosh. Um, do you think I could use white bands for the eyes? Um, I mean, you could. Will it look good? No idea. I'm so picky about my loom things. Like, I have to have all the things. Otherwise, I don't think they look good. I'm very picky. Yeah. So, I know you guys asked me if I'm excited for Christmas. Are you guys excited for Christmas? I'm not because I'm biased. Um, but are you guys excited for Christmas? It's so bad, the chat delay. have a head he's going pretty well <laughs> yes oh, okay okay so Peter's name is actually Susie they're using their brother's account everyone is saying yes but me now I feel worse <laughs> definitely a Grinch here Ooh, okay you guys are all excited for Christmas nice You know, I would realize after because my mom made me give her a Christmas list because she said that she, I didn't want any presents, but she said she's buying me stuff anyways. And I should have put brain balloon bands on my list because, yeah, <laughs> I'm running low on all my bands. <laughs> Brett says Ginger's only excited for the cookies. That is true. I'm only here for the cookies. I know me and my sibling, Brett, were planning on Christmas Eve to make cookies together. I want to do gingerbread cookies, but last year with the gingerbread cookies we made, um, bread almost threw up because of the smell of molasses, which I thought smelled fine, but they hated it, so it's fine. 
<laughs> I think I'm, 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 I'm hoping we do gingerbreads this year. I'll probably post on my story what we bake on Christmas Eve because me and bread, we always bake on Christmas Eve. So we're going to make something, but I'm not sure what. I'm using my dad's account. You can call me Ellie. Okay, that makes names here so much easier. Oh, someone's named Draculaura. Yes, Monster High, I think. Um, how do you keep the band so close together whenever I, they look so spread apart? You're probably stretching your bands when you loom because I used to have the same issue, but it usually only happens if you're stretching your bands while you loom or if you're stuffing it, you're like overstuffing it. So that's probably your issue. Probably. Oh my god, okay, I keep messing up. I can't do two things at once. Multiclasking is not happening. <laughs> Nicole Maxwell says, I already got one Christmas present. Four new tires for my car. Wow, that's such an adult Christmas present. <laughs> car tires. No. I think I t yeah. I think I talked about it in a tutorial. I was telling... Well, I think it's a tutorial I haven't posted yet because I think t tomorrow I'm posting the... I have a duck here. I'm posting this guy's hat. The duck, my duck design's getting a hat. Just, why not? I just made this for fun. And I'm going to be posting it tomorrow, but I think in the tutorial I was talking about what I got both of my siblings for Christmas because we did give each other gifts. Though. Yep, yep. I probably should have posted I was live on Instagram. <laughs> Whoops. Hopefully everyone has their notifications on and it's all fine. So hard to count and talk at the same time. I can't do both. I'm gonna watch the video. No, Brett, I didn't tell them exactly what I got you, but okay, so me, if you watch the video, you'll hear me talking about this. But me and Brett decided we're both getting each other nail polish, so yeah. I didn't tell them what nail polish I got you, but we both got each other nail polish, which is boring. I don't know what to talk about. Ask me questions, because I'm going to get awkward real quick. Um, Brad always yells at me, because I've gone live with Brad on Instagram before, and she always yells at me, says I get awkward, and I'm boring in my live streams, so I don't know how to be interesting. And then I get nervous, and I start rambling. <laughs> okay. We have questions. Thank you. <laughs> um, do you do embroidery? Uh, I've tried. I don't think I did it correctly. I embroidered something for my sister, actually, and I think it didn't, I don't know if I did it right, but I discovered my school has an embroidery machine that I'm allowed to use, so when I go back to school, I've been working on some designs, so that hopefully when I go back, I dropped a band, that's why I'm picking it up, um, hopefully when I go back, I can use the embroidery machine, I have some designs, I think it would be fun to make, like, some kind of loom-related, like, shirt or something, so we'll see if, I want to see if I could do that, I don't know, the only thing I'm trying to figure out is, like, this is, like, boring, but I'm trying to figure out, like, how, like, how do I have to draw it in order to use it on a embroidery machine? I don't know. And I can't figure it out, and so far none of the tutorials I've watched have told, told me, so I'm gonna have to keep looking. But yeah, I think it would be cool to make, like, some kind of shirt or something that's, like, Rainbow Loom related or, like, that has one of my loom designs on it. Would be fun. Uh, will you be on for more hours? I'm going to make the reindeer. I'm only going to be on for an hour because I feel like above an hour, like this video is going to be a pain to watch it back. I don't know if anyone will watch it back, but in case anyone wants to, I don't want this video to be ridiculously long. I've been doing Rainbow for two years. Hey, that's a long time. And then someone else, Keith says, I think I, I just got mixed everyone's names up. Um, says I've been looming since I was four. Oh my God. Interesting. Everyone's saying how long they've been looming. And Christina says they've been looming for four years. Wow. I feel old. How long have I been looming for? Um, I think since I was 15, so I think it's seven years now. It might have been 14. I don't remember. It's been too long. Okay. We're on the easy part of my pattern. He's coming along quite nicely. I am going to get to his robe soon, and I, I don't know. Should I just do gray for the robe, or is that boring? Should I do a fun color? Because I was just going to make his robe this gray color, but now I'm having... I don't know. 
Everyone's still saying how long they've been looming for. Oh my gosh, okay. Nicole says she's been looming for nine years. That's longer than any of us. Oh my gosh. At least I think it is. Time is weird. I don't know what year we're in. You know, I was thinking, and now after being live at least one time, I think it would be fun to maybe try to design something live. It would probably be chaotic. I'd have to fix my camera setup so you can see my hands and not me. But, yeah. Uh, do I do amigurumi? Uh, I've tried it. I think I made, like, two things with amigurumi and then decided I like fans better. But I do know how to do it. I just don't do it. How much longer am I going to stay live? Um, probably, like, half an hour more and then I'm going to get off and do other things. I actually, do I know how to end this live stream? It's a good question. I don't. I tested how YouTube Live works once, and then I was like, it's fine, I'll figure it out. I do not know how to do anything. Um, do I crochet with yarn? Um, I can. See, yarn is like the rest, where it's like, I know how to, but do I do it? No. I mainly paint, uh, do clay stuff and rainbow loom. Those are like the three things I do. But, yeah, and I know how to crochet, and I know how to do amigurumi, but I just don't do it. Like, to me, it's just so similar to Rainbow Loom, because it's like, like, yeah. Uh, my sibling says that they are better at me at crocheting, and that is true. I don't know how to, cr they crochet much more than me. They actually made me a hat. And Valentina says, hi, Ginger. Hi, Valentina. <laughs> Thank you for coming. <laughs> And Christina asked again, how long am I going to be live? Uh, half an hour more, in case you didn't hear it earlier. Cool. I'm, uh, I'm kind of questioning my own pattern. This always happens whenever I make my own pattern. I, I, like, I think, I'm like, should I trust my own pattern? The answer is no. I feel like I shouldn't trust my own pattern. But I should, because I probably wrote it down correctly. But the slight chance that I didn't write it down correctly scares me. <laughs> Uh, what other hobbies do I have? So, besides Ray Bloom, like I said, I paint, but that's mainly for school. That painting, all the paintings behind me are mine. And then I do clay, so I do, like, polymer clay stuff. Uh, I haven't posted much of my polymer clay things on my account yet, but I'm going to soon. And I also roller skate. Not very well, but I do do it. <laughs> I think that's about all my hobbies. Do I do anything else? I do, I like, I don't know. I also like drawing on my tablet, too, but I don't do that very well, either. Just for fun. So I guess hobbies are for fun. Um, have you heard of the Woobles? Wubble, it's an crocheting community. No, I have not heard of that community at all. I don't, I don't know. Haza says they're crocheting right now, wow. I know a lot of loomers crochet as well, but I just, I'm like the one who doesn't. Crocheting's fun. I just, I don't know. I, like, if, I guess it's just, like, I like the feel of fans. That sounds, like, I, like, the feel of bands better. They feel, because it's, like, almost the same. And I just prefer bands. But, yeah. Um, is roller skating hard? Yeah, I feel like it depends. Because I've seen people who are more athletic than me skate and learn in, like, two months or something. <laughs> but I've been roller skating, like, I, like, barely, like, seriously for, like, the past couple months when I moved to my college because I joined a roller skating group, but I think it's pretty hard. <laughs> Huzzah says they roller skate too. Hey, how well are you, how, like, how good are you at roller skating? Because I'm, I can go forwards, I can slightly go backwards, and I still don't know how to stop, but it's fun. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, Okay. I've been wanting to learn, but I feel like I give up on roller skating. Yeah, I feel like it depends, because, like, a lot of the, when I went to college, I kind of met up with a group of girls, and we roller skate together, like, once a week, but, I don't know, most, we all, but I, like, I know my sibling, Bread, tried it, my brother tried roller skating as well, and they both quit, so, I guess it depends. You definitely have to get past a phase where it's, like, horrifying, because I feel like the first like month of roller skating you just feel like you're gonna die on skates and then you get used to it and it's fine but like the first month is just like you feel like you're gonna die at least I did like you're just gonna fall off and that'll be it 
Do I ever loom knit animals? I don't know what that means. I Nope, I don't know what that means. <laughs> I've been roller skating since 2018. Oh man, I expect you to be amazing then. And Valentina says, hi Ginger, I love your designs. Oh, thank you. I'm glad you like them. But we'll see. Okay, so we're almost done with his head. I didn't think I would get this far while I was live, but I guess I do loom pretty fast. And it's funny because I know everyone says I go super like fast in my tutorials and they're like, slow down, Ginger. I always get comments like that. And, but I can actually loom faster and I am going slow in tutorials. So yeah, there we go. We have his head. So now we need to switch. I also dropped my pattern book. Lovely. I forgot what the next step is. Um, let me find the pattern. I have a bunch of secrets in here. No, I don't. I don't have any secrets in here. I think the only pattern I have written down that I haven't made a tutorial for is my cupcake design that I posted on Instagram. And then forgot about. <laughs> okay. Hazan says, same, I love your designs. They're so easy. Oh, thank you. I always have such a hard time because I get people who are like, are your designs easy or hard? And I'm just like, I don't know. I try my best to teach you guys, but I don't know. It's like so hard to say if they're easy or not because I've just been looming for so long. I'm like, I, I don't know. Is it easy? Who knows? Um, it's like loom knitting, but in animal form. I know what loom knitting is, but at the same time, I don't. Like, I've loomed hats before, but is that, like, on the circle loom, or is that something else? Um, my sibling bread says, girl, I barely did, like, one row of my hat, I'm crocheting. Girl, get faster at crocheting. That's the solution. Um, Keith says, you make your designs really easy to follow, and I think that's good quality. Oh, thank you. I'm glad that I'm getting good feedback on my tutorials. Uh, Nicole Maxwell says, did I figure out my cupcake design? I thought I figured it out, and then I saw my cupcake. He's on the floor. Um, I think he fell, he fell out of my loom bin, and he's on the floor right now. But I saw my cupcake design, and I think I want to fix the frosting more. I thought it was done, and then I looked at it, and I was like, no, it's not done. I need to come back. I need to fix it. I don't like it. <laughs> it needs help. I like, I like the bit, like the bottom part of the cupcake design. Do I have it? Can I show it to you? No, it's too far. I would have to get up and I'm not going to get up, but I thought I liked it, but I looked at it again and I think it, I don't think it's good. So there's that. <laughs> we'll see what happens with the cupcake. I may wake it again and then decide, but the cupcake designs, I'll post the photo in the community tab because I don't think I've shown the people on YouTube my cupcake design, but it's, it's struggling. Okay, let's see what other messages are. I love all your designs, but the reindeer is by far my favorite. Oh, thank you. I love the reindeer as well. He turned out so much better than I was expecting. I don't know how to say it. What's, let me let me try to say your name. I think it's Sylvana. It says hi. Hi, Sylvana. Um, all your designs are... Oh, and then Hazas says all your designs are so cute and easy to follow. I think I already read that one, but I'm not 100% certain. And then Peter says... Um, okay. Sylvana says, can I do Hello Kitty? I mean, you can try to make a Hello Kitty design. If you're asking, can... Oh, you meant can, can I do Hello Kitty? A Hello Kitty design would be cute. I'll add it to my list, but no guarantees in the next five billion years I'll make a Hello Kitty. Uh, your designs are so cute, but can you make another fruit? Um, I mean, I have the strawberry. What do I have? I have a strawberry, I have a pineapple, but I feel like I would change the pineapple now if I redid it. Is that all the fruit I have? I have a strawberry, blueberry, pineapple. I only have three fruits. I don't make food much. I've noticed I mainly make animals, so... Yeah, I don't know. Geo Slims and Crafts says, hey, hi. I'm glad you could make it. I think I've seen you on Instagram. I'm not 100% certain. Um, Peter says, have you loomed your favorite animal? No, I have not. My favorite animal is a seal. I love seals. They're cute. Adorable. But I have not made a loom one yet. And I think it's because 
like I just put on pressure like I want the seal to be perfect and I know I'll be disappointed if it isn't so yeah I'm scared to make a <laughs> seal but yeah, man I don't know there's a couple designs that I really want to do but then like I'm so scared to do because I want them to be perfect and I'm picky about it I feel like most of the designs I've made I kind of had low expectations for and they just turned out good on accident so I know if I try to do an animal like I actually like, it's it's harder, at least I find it harder. I feel like that's why maybe the unicorn's hard is because I like have high, such high expectations for the unicorn. I can't make a unicorn. But, yeah. Okay, let's see. Um, Key says, I really like the alpaca and the balloon dog. The alpaca is one of my favorites. I was thinking about it the other day and I was like, man, that was a good design. I think I peaked at that moment. Every time I make a really good design, I'm like, that's it. That's my masterpiece. <laughs> We're done here. All downhill from here. But hopefully, hopefully I'll keep making good designs. I don't know. I feel like I was, I've been working on some Christmas designs. I made the reindeer. I was working on a couple other things. They're not turning out the greatest. And I'm like, maybe I'm done with Christmas designs for this year. Because they're not really happening. So that's a thing. Uh, Brad says grapes design when... Never. <laughs> I feel like grapes would be hard to do. Also, the issue, I, because I like putting faces on all my, like, things, right? And, like, if I made a grape, would you put a face on, like, the whole grape bunch? Or would you do it on, you'd probably put faces on each individual grape, right? I don't know. So that, I don't know. Too much thought already. Not making grapes ever. No, I'm joking. I, maybe I'll do grapes one day. But I don't know. There's a, there's a lot of designs I'm missing. I feel like I'm missing a lot of food designs. I realized recently I mainly do animals. But I feel like that's even in my art as well. As you could, Well, I have a cupcake back there. But I also just, I like to paint animals. I've noticed I mainly paint animals. I don't know what it is. But I do a lot of animals. Uh, let's see. What else do we have? He says I really like otters. I agree. Otters are one of my favorites. <laughs> And I really, yeah, um, thoughts. <laughs> Nicole Maxwell says, I love cats. Valentina says, Ginger, how long have you been looming? I, I want to say seven years, but I'm not 100% certain. It may be more than that. It may be shorter. Time is weird, and I don't know what year we're in. So it's something like that. I'm also surprised. We might have a whole Grogu by the time I finish this, minus, like, all his accessories, because he has got, like, this extra long robe, this... Thing, whatever this is on his neck but I think I might be able to finish the main part of Groku so yeah um okay what else keeping up with the chat is hard I thought it would be easier I've been having a hard time keeping up with the chat which is fun because I like talking to you guys it's fun um Huzzah says I love frogs they are so cute I disagree with you there I, I, <laughs> I don't like frogs I don't know if you guys have okay me and Brad, we, me and my sibling, we talk about this because I, have you ever seen a wa frog walking? Because I do not like that. It is unsettling. I never thought about what frogs do if they're not hopping. They walk and it's creepy. I don't like it. So I don't like frogs. Um, some frogs are okay. Like I feel like poison dart frogs, like those guys are cute. But then my sister sends me these nasty like toads and I'm like, nah, nah, frogs, no. M. Loom says seals are too cute. They're one of my favorite animals too. Yes, seals are amazing. They're like, I think they kind of look like dogs too. Well, we have a chihuahua and I think our chihuahua kind of looks like a seal. She's got the big eyes. Like she could be a seal. Um, Spooter says, hi. Hi, Spooter. Angel says, can you make a pig? I really love your animal designs. Oh my God. A pig is another one that I have tried to make a pig for years and it just keeps not happening. Like, like there's just certain designs that are not cooperating um, and yeah, I also just saw someone point out the stop sign in the back. That's a part of my painting. Now you can see the whole thing. It's a chameleon on a stop sign. And I kind of want to move him. He might be removed. I brought my paintings home from school that I've done more recently and I kind of want to replace him. <laughs> someone, someone, we were discussing grapes in case... Like, you just joined, but someone said face on the grape stem. I don't know. Grapes would be tricky, Keith. I grapes, man. Um, Geosum's craft is making the reindeer. Yes, I'm so excited. I want to see someone's. I haven't seen anyone post a reindeer on Instagram. I haven't seen a reindeer yet, so I can't wait. 
Nicole Maxwell said feelings, but she did. I think we're still in the grape discussion here, and she did put the faces on all the individual grapes. Huzzah says, have I ever played Roblox before? Yes, I have. I actually joined Roblox when it was first starting. Like, when did we join? My sibling knows this. I think we joined in, like, 2011 or 2010, and I still have my Roblox account, and actually, when I've been on break... I, me and my sister have been playing fishing simulator on Roblox because why not? And it's fun. You get to collect glowy fish and I am taking, I'm just taking a break. So I've just been doing fun things on my vacation. Also, it's slowly getting darker in my room. I'm sorry if you can see that. The sun just decided to dip completely. Someone's asking what's my Roblox name. It's a secret. You can probably guess based on what my username is everywhere. But I don't know how much you guys talk to me in Roblox. I'm always... I don't do much. Like, I honestly only use Roblox now to play with my siblings. I used to be involved in all kinds of groups in Roblox. I was in a cheerleading group in Roblox for the longest time when I was younger. I did all kinds of things. Me and my sister used to do fashion groups, too. And we would, like, go to fashion shows. I won a lot of fashion shows on Roblox. But it's been years now, and I feel like I'm way too old to be on it. So now I just fish, and occasionally I like playing the game Assassin 2, so... Fun. What else? And Loom says I'm posting the reindeer soon. Oh, awesome. I can't wait to see it because I've been waiting. Even though I've been awful about posting things. Like, I made oops, I made this pie that Zimmy sent me the pattern to make because she was having some issues with it so I could fix it. She asked if I could make it. I don't know. I think she's having some issues with it, but I haven't posted this pie yet. But it's cute. Zimmy made this, by the way. This is not my design, but she sent it to me. Okay, wait. What else? Do I like making mini designs? I love making mini designs. I was thinking today that if I made a mini turtle design, that would be so cute. Like, wouldn't it? Like, I don't know if you guys remember my turtle design, but I love it. And I'm like, a little tiny turtle design would be cute. So I might try to do that this week just because I think it could look cute. Brad said 2011. Okay, so I joined Roblox in 2011. I don't remember if it was 11 or 10. Mmm. Okay, I got really behind on the chat. You're going to have to... Okay. He says, I think I, you should try to do a Boston Terrier. Yeah, I think some more dogs would be cute. I love corgis. I think corgis are so cute. But I haven't made a corgi yet either. It's on the long to-do list of things I need to design. AD Craft says, I made your reindeer design today. It's super cute. Yes, I love hearing everyone make my reindeer. I'm glad you guys like my designs. I don't know why. Like, I know I see a lot of people like obviously like watch my videos but it's I'm like always convinced that no one actually makes my stuff I'm like because I only ever see a few things and I know a lot of people don't have Instagram so they don't always tag me but I'm always kind of convinced that no one makes it I'm like yeah th those people are just clicking on my video looking at it and being like nope I'm not making this and then just like leaving so <laughs> like hearing you guys actually say you make my designs and like them it's good because I, I don't know I'm really convinced no one does sometimes uh, Ginger, will you stream more? Maybe. I'm going to see how this goes. I think after today I learned I might have to fix my setup a little bit, but maybe I'll stream more if you guys want me to stream more. I don't know. Definitely not all the time because I find, find out if I stream all the time, I run out of things to talk about. So I was thinking maybe streaming like once every like two months or something like that could be cool maybe. Um... <laughs> Brent says Roblox is for everyone. Brent, you're just saying Roblox is for everyone because you're old too. <laughs> you're biased um nicole maxwell says i have two to three boxes of rain balloon things i have made yeah i need a new rain balloon box mine is completely exploding i think i'm gonna have to update etsy soon i think i might list some of my clowns on etsy because i just have extra ones and i looked at the floor because all my loom things are like on a box lid on the floor ever since i moved home my room has been a little bit of a disaster but it's okay so he says the mini things are the best. I agree. And I'm going to make a billion milli things just for you. Because I love... I love making mini designs. But the thing is I'm always on the fence about mini designs. Because some... Like a lot of beginners say it is hard to make my mini designs. So I don't want to make stuff as hard for people. So I'll make it a little bigger so it's easier. But if you like my mini designs, I will make them just for you. <laughs> um, okay. Jillian says... What stitch do we put the arms on? I put mine and they look like ears. Um, yeah, so the fact... <laughs> I have a bad habit with Tsum Tsums that I, I tie their arms in afterwards, so I never actually put the arms on during the pattern. So, good luck. I recommend... I don't know what you could do. I guess you could cut the arms out 
and then I would just tie them in afterwards. I I don't I know like the thing with the sum sums is everyone puts the thing in, in the rows, but yeah, sorry about that. I I don't know why I just always forget the arms. I always forget to test. If you notice in all my tutorials, I never tell you you need stuffing because I always forget we need stuffing for these things, and I always forget to put the arms in in sum sums. It's, it's a thing. <laughs> okay. Huzzah also says you're never too old to play Roblox. Well, I'm glad you guys think that. I don't know if I am. I feel like everyone on there is like 10 and I'm 22 and everyone's like, Ooh, a little old. Um, Andy says, can you make more Christmas designs? They're so cute. Oh, that's funny. I laughed because we were discussing earlier in the stream, if you just joined, that I am not the biggest Christmas person. And I feel bad because I feel like so many people love Christmas, but I'm not. I don't know what it is. It's like nothing against Christmas. I just feel like I have all the Christmas designs. I made a present last year. I made, let's see, I have a present. Once again, we're counting all my designs. I have a present. I can only remember, I have a peppermint design. I have an elf design. What else do I have? Is that all my Christmas things? No, I have more Christmas things. Well, we have a reindeer now. Isn't there other, I thought I have more Christmas designs than that. I don't remember. I have a Christmas Lumigurumi Christmas playlist if you guys want to see that, but yeah. Okay, we're getting a lot of suggestions. Honestly though, guys, if you have any design suggestions, just suggest them now and hopefully I'll remember. No guarantee I'll make the thing, but I am, I will think about making the thing. Oh, I did a hot cocoa, thank you, Keith. Yeah, I did a hot cocoa design, that one's cute too. I, I was remembering the other day in the hot cocoa video, I told a story of how I nearly ate a maggot while drinking hot chocolate last year and everyone grossed out in the comments. But it's a common thing in our house. I don't know why, but the maggots like it here and I. I'm still kind of scared of hot chocolate because of that, because that's not fun. Okay, I'm going to lose since they're almost up with the reindeer body. Yes, it goes really quick after you did the body. The body always takes a while. You should make a Yeti. Actually, I was thinking about making a Yeti because we have a Christmas ornament that's a Yeti, and it looks super cute. So actually, a lot of my designs, I see, like, things. Like, the reindeer was inspired by the reindeer from the Grinch. He's a very round reindeer, and I was like, a round reindeer would be adorable. And I, there's actually been a lot of my loom designs that are inspired by, like, various things I see in real life that are already 3D objects. And I'm like, I'm going to turn that into a loom thing, and I usually do. So, Geoloom says I should make a fox. A fox would be good. I also want to really make a raccoon, but I haven't. I had an idea on how to make a raccoon, and then I forgot how to make a raccoon. So, fun. <laughs> Uh, let's see what else, what else, what else. Um, Nicole Maxwell says art will have, uh, I don't know what that is. Oh, he has all kinds of things. Cool. Um, what else? I keep really losing where I was in the chat. Um, okay, thank you. I thought we had to put them during the pattern. You don't have to put the Tsum Tsums on during, Tsum Tsum arms on during the pattern. That's what Jillian is talking about here. I just, I like to put the arms in after. I don't know. It's just me. What is the next tutorial other than the Santa hat? That's a giant mystery. I honestly don't know. I planned up to here because I'm like, okay, up to Christmas, I'll put out the reindeer tutorial, I'll put out the Santa hat. That's it for this year. I'm not feeling festive. Um, I also just had, was it like very busy at the end of school, so I didn't really have anything ready. Sometimes I work on my designs early, but I didn't have any time. So next tutorial, I don't know what the next tutorial is going to be. I have the cupcake almost ready. What else have I not made a tutorial for? Um, I'm looking at my loom stuff like, which of you did have I not done? Because I don't remember. <laughs> I don't know. What else? What have I not done? Um, hmm. <laughs> Someone, I can't read your username. I, th I think it's in Chinese because they say, I am the biggest fan from the beginning. Love from China. Oh, thank you. It's always so weird to think I have people who watch me from everywhere. Oh my god, people are talking about something in the chat. Hold up. Hold up. I'm losing it. Someone says I should make a teddy bear. I think a teddy bear would be cute. I mean, technically, Brooklyn's panda design, you could turn into a bear very easily by just not making it, like, panda pattern, just turn into a bear. So that you could do that. Um, Angie says you should make a mini candy cane. I would make it... Oh, I could do a mini candy cane. I don't know how I would do that. I think I... Hmm. Now you guys are giving me ideas. I'm going to try to make a mini candy cane after the stream. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. I'll put all these ideas on my list and we'll see. Please, 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 please. 
Um, an updated candy cane tutorial would be great. I don't have a candy cane tutorial on my channel, so... Okay. People are just saying I need to do a mini candy cane. There's a riot in the chat. Okay. <laughs> Not an actual riot, but you guys are like, yes, do it. And I'm like, mm, I don't know about that. Uh, Jillian says, I also like to put the arms in after. Yeah. But I feel like I didn't actually discover people put things, like, in the pattern during the pattern until I started making Tsum Tsums. And then everyone was, like, attaching things during the pattern. And I was like, who does this? I don't do this. I attach everything afterwards. I also just like attaching afterwards because, like, you can kind of pick where you put it more than sometimes when you put it during the pattern. It's a little harder. Okay, we have more questions. <laughs> I'm so behind. Uh, Keith says, can you make more Tsum Tsum animals? Yes. Actually, that's when I can maybe... I have a lot of Tsum Tsum patterns. I can release the Tsum Tsums that I can release the patterns for. I did the cat Tsum Tsum that I completely forgot about. And... Yeah. Okay. So let's see what else. Um, so is it plus one like? I guess that means they like the video. Thank you for liking the video if you did. I know it helps with YouTube algorithms. I actually don't really get into YouTube algorithms or anything like that. I know a lot of YouTubers worry about that, but I kind of, I don't really worry about it because eh, eh. I make designs so people can make them. But and I try to do my best. That way it's easier for you guys to find my designs, but I don't really worry about that. But I do appreciate the likes. Also, because usually I kind of, like, use the likes to kind of gauge how much I, you guys like the video. Because I know that usually kind of lines up, so. Yeah. I also just completely lost the chat. Oh, there we go. Someone said a sloth. Oh my god, I was working on a sloth design as well. I, there, I feel like I have so many design ideas going on at once. I need to, like, fix a few. And stop doing so many because, yeah, yeah. Uh, Olivia says, hi, Ginger. Just wanted to ask, did you make figure out how to make the mini dinos yet? I forgot about that. I, I had mini dinos as well. Okay, I need to make a list of designs I have started and then just completely abandoned because that, that would be a long list. Oh, my God. Okay, the chat's going really fast. Well, kind of not, not really fast, but... <laughs> I don't know. Oops, oops. What am I doing? Um, mini dino. Okay, a bunch of people just saying I should make mini dinos. I'll come back to the mini dinos. I want to maybe figure out how to make a pterodactyl and a T-Rex before maybe I get into the mini dinos. I think I need to finish the dino collection. Or, like, we're missing, we're missing a T-Rex. We're missing a pterodactyl. I need to get onto those. Huzzah says they're going to make a bee. I'm reading the chat a lot of order. <laughs> Uh, Keith says, can I make Squishmallows? I haven't made Squishmallows, but I know Shannon Looms on Instagram has made Squishmallows, as well as Olympus the Loomer has two Squishmallows on his channel already. So there's people making Squishmallows, which is why I feel like I haven't made any, is I'm like, they're kind of just doing their Squishmallow thing, and I'm making other things. So, Squishmallows exist, and I maybe can ask some people if they will let me do the tutorial for the Squishmallows, if you guys want Squishmallows, because I occasionally reach out to people to ask if I can do tutorials if I feel like it's a design you guys would like or that I just really like and I I don't know I occasionally reach out to people but maybe I can reach out to them we'll see okay so after the dino everyone's saying telling me to make dinosaurs there's not everyone telling me to make squishmallows yep um okay <laughs> Oh, Lumba Sophia said, hi. Hi, Lumba Sophia. I forgot to post on Instagram, so sorry if you're late, but we, I might be getting off soon because I've already almost been live for an entire hour. Oops, oops, oops. I'm pressing buttons I should have not be pressing. How do I hide that? Okay, we're good. Uh, Levin says, do I watch anime? I've watched one anime when I had COVID. I watched free. I didn't finish the entire anime. I think I finished seasons one and two. So I've watched anime, and honestly, anime is kind of cool, but the only reason I don't watch more of it is because I really only watch TV when I'm looming, so I can't read subtitles and see what I'm doing. But yeah, anime is interesting, and there's a lot of cool, like, things. It's just, I haven't, like, I don't really, I don't really have, like, I can't loom and <laughs> watch things, and that's why I don't. It's the same reason me and my mom and then my sibling, we watch a lot of 
like Hispanic Disney shows, like well, not Hispanic Disney shows, like Spanish Disney shows are in Spanish, and I can't watch them in Loom, and it's the reason we don't watch a bunch. Okay, I am behind in the chat. Brett said, "OMG, a fuzzy cow design." Don't put that in the chat. We don't want a fuzzy cow. You know, I was thinking, someone said I should make a big design of my narwhal, like I did the duck, and I think a big cow design could be cute. Like, I make a bigger version of my cow, so we have my little baby cow, then we have a bigger cow. I'm thinking of doing that, because it's kind of easy to make my designs bigger, because I just, like, do what I did, but do it bigger. I don't know if that makes sense, but, yeah. Okay, a uh, person says, I think you should make a walrus just like your YouTube icon. That is a great idea. But like how we were discussing earlier, that I put a lot of pressure on designs that I actually like really, really want to do. <sighs> I want to do a narwhal, but there's just so much pressure. Forever Looming says, I should do a mini hamburger. Maybe. Maybe, boy. Huzzah says, what's my favorite song? Ooh, that's hard, especially with, like, Taylor Swift's new albums. I don't know what my favorite song is anymore. What's one of my favorite songs? I don't know. Me and my sister, I've been, like, really liking The Great War by Taylor Swift. 10 out of 10 song. Uh, I think her name is, I don't know. There's a lot of letters in that name. <laughs> Could you make a Shrek and Donkey? I don't think I'll make Shrek or Donkey. I've seen that movie, but I don't really like it. Oops. Uh, Nicole Maxwell says, have I finished Miraculous Ladybug? No. In fact, I know there's new episodes, but they, they're coming on Disney Plus on the 28th of December, and I have not seen them yet, so I have not finished Miraculous at all. And you said yes, please, but I don't know what. To what? What are we yes, pleasing? <laughs> there's such a delay in the chat. I feel bad because I, I attend a lot of live streams with an art people I follow, and I'm always not saying exactly what we're talking about in the chat, and they always get lost, and then they read my comment, and they're like, what the heck is she on? Yeah, I'm feeling like that right now, because I'm so behind. Uh, Keith says, I know Felix Swifty did this, but can you do french fries? Yes. Yes, I can. I, I can try to do french fries. French fries would be cute. Honestly, you guys are giving me so many ideas now. I just need to go in the Lumen Cave for, like five weeks I'll come out with a billion new designs and I won't see I won't see my sister before I go back to school <laughs> I'm kidding um bread's been if I haven't been looming a bunch bra blame bread we've been attached at the hip lately because we've just been hanging out bread also said ginger will have a grape <laughs> of the grape crisis over the fries like <laughs> but the face is on all the fries <laughs> my sister roasting me in the chat man um Okay, you guys can say that. Peter says, can I make a mini cow? A mini cow would be cute. Very cute. Um, okay. Swifty. Yes, I'm a Swifty. Massive Swifty. Excited for the Eras tour. I got tickets by some miracle. <laughs> and you said you should rate your designs for the whole year from least to greatest. I would watch that. You know, I was thinking about doing something similar to this. And I actually haven't told my this idea to Brad, my sibling, yet. Because I was thinking of doing a video like I did last year where I show you guys all my designs and then doing another video where I have bread rate my designs because I feel like I'm totally biased and I don't know. But I think it would be interesting to see bread roast slash just rate all my designs. She sees everything I make because I just show her everything I make. But I think it could be fun to have bread rate all my loom designs. I don't know if she would be down to do that either, but... I think it could be fun. I'm also scared of her because she's harsh. She's going to be like, you mess this up completely. And I'll be like, okay. So, <laughs> but maybe I could rank them myself too. But I feel like I would be like, they're all perfect. And it wouldn't be fun. Okay. Huzzah says, what's your favorite painting you painted? I, probably the narwhal painting that's behind me is on this side. So right there. That's a loom narwhal. It's kind of hard to see because it's in the back. But it's a loom narwhal surrounded by yarn. I posted this one on Instagram. And I think it could be, I, I love that painting. That's probably the best one I've done. Also because I had tried to paint like the texture of loom bands before and it didn't go well. And I've tried to paint yarn before and it went awful. And then with this painting, I actually did it. So yeah. A forever looming got tickets to the Eros tour too. I'm glad you got them because I know you said you didn't have any. So yay. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? Um, 
a Dotson, uh, how do you say it? Dotson, Dotson, I'm bad at pronunciation, um, it's fine, would be cool, like the long dogs, I agree, long dogs, gotta love them, Brett says you should still cancel me if they know I'm the reason you don't loom, yeah, blame Brett right here, the whole reason I'm not in the looming cave, <laughs> It's been an hour, Ginger. Thank you for letting me know. I'll be getting off in a few minutes. I'm just going to finish my row. Wait, am I almost done with the row? Oh, I just finished the row. Never mind. I'll get off in a few minutes. Because I'm reading the chat and I'm having fun. I knew I, I can go slightly over an hour if I want. I just don't want this video to be ridiculously long, so. Yeah. <laughs> Hazal says you should make more vlogs. Yeah, I'm going to try. Actually, I also leaned way too far. I'm sorry. I see the delay. I see myself leaning in to read the chat. I'm like, that looks ugly um <laughs> anyways i've been trying to do more vlogs oh am i frozen or is that my wi-fi clashing with this wi-fi am i frozen because it's frozen on this screen oh no it was just being weird okay i thought i froze um i, I don't know i'm not frozen okay it was my laptop then <laughs> but yeah, I'm trying to do more vloggy videos, but it's just harder for me to do. Okay, everyone's saying no, I'm not frozen. Thank you. It's just my laptop decided to freeze then. We stand my laptop. Okay. I don't know. The vlogs are hard. I've been trying to do more vlogs, but I just, I'm so bad at filming videos that aren't tutorials I discovered. So while I'm trying, it's not going perfect. So, yeah. But I'll try. I actually really am proud of the video I posted recently, which I think I, I don't remember what I named it, but it's something like a painting I did for my painting class. That video turned out really good and I'm proud of how I edited it. I've been trying to get better. So yeah. So I think that's going to be it for this live stream because I don't want this video, like I said, to be ridiculously long so people can actually maybe watch it back if they want to. And I feel like after an hour, the video is just, it's just too long. So thank you for everyone who came. I'm glad I actually had people here for my first live stream on YouTube because I've, I don't know, I was worried no one was going to show up even though Brad said they would watch me from the living room. But thank you everyone for coming. I am going to finish this row and then I'll go because now I started a row and I got to finish it. <laughs> and she said, no, don't leave. Yeah, no, I'm sorry. After an hour too, I feel like if you've ever watched my tutorials you know after an hour my voice starts to feel like it's gonna die and we've hit that point too so yeah uh levin says when am i going to stream again i was thinking before i go back to school and i want it to be on a weekend but next weekend is new year's so that's a hard weekend so maybe the weekend new year's i'll do one more stream before i go back to school i'll try to work out my setup because i don't know if this is the best setup <laughs> Having me always look at the other screen so I can see the chat. We'll maybe have to see if I can do a better setup. But yeah. And Brad says, OMG, now you can hang out with me now. See, if I'm not doing any looming, it is this person's fault. Um, <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much for everyone for staying. I am going to do the last two stitches so I end on an even row. But yeah. Oh my god, everyone's saying thank you in the chat. You're all so nice. I don't know why. I was, like, so slightly afraid that you guys were all going to roast me. I'm glad you didn't. Okay, so here's what Grogu looks like as of when I'm finishing this. I will finish him. He'll be on Instagram eventually. He does have a gray robe because I didn't know what color to do. And, yeah. So, I'm going to set everything aside so I can end the stream. <laughs> But thank you guys all for coming. Um, I guess, I don't know, do I say subscribe? Do I tell you to subscribe? I assume you're all subscribed. But yeah, subscribe if you want to see whatever tutorials are coming. And if I live stream again, that way you can be notified. And I'll link my Instagram and all that. It's already linked all down in the description because I already did that earlier. So yeah, I think that's it. I will see you guys soon. Hopefully I'll live stream again soon. Merry Christmas to all of you. Everyone's saying Merry Christmas in the chat. I'm such a great, I'm not a Christmas person. Okay, doesn't matter. Um... But yeah, thank you guys. And someone says thanks for making tutorials. Oh, thank, you. thank you for watching my tutorials. Oh my god, I'm so bad at ending things. But yeah, I think that's it. I will see you soon in some kind of other video. But yeah, I think that's it for this one. So I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Let's hope I know how to end this because I don't know if I do. Okay, cool. Bye.